rugby, rugby, rugby. Football was a second class sport. My name is Irene Hutchison and I'm honorary president of Foyk Royal Albert United. What a mouthful now. <laughs> There's not much happening in here, like. I'm David Strafty, defender. I'm Kevin Strafty. I'm on the committee here. I play as a striker. Sometimes doing help put the nets up, poles out, a wee bit of training, just general stuff. We started doing meetings between two clubs, both committees. We thought that the best way forward for both clubs would be to come together as one. Two teams merged, Hoyt United then Hoyt Royal Albert. I'm Aidan Riley and I'm the vice captain of Hoyt Royal Albert United. I would often come down here and watch the odd game and there would be nobody in the stands. Nobody to support boys that they don't know who they are. It was all Edinburgh players. I'm George Shepard. I'm the Hoyt Royal Albert manager. What we're trying to do is we're trying to build a local team. My name's John Drysdale and I'm the assistant manager at Hoyt Royal Albert United. I'm Derek Ramage and I'm co-chairman with Irene. The way they're going now, they're putting their hearts into it, and that's what we're wanting. Two pounds for the programme. Thank you very much. When I wake up in the morning, game day, the belly goes. An average hour is doing early, nets up, get the pies in that, the bar ready, tidy up. Saturdays, you go out, play football, win, lose, or draw. Right, guys, listen up. We get them down here. We got the win last week. We're buzzing at training. We don't fear anybody down here, okay? We work hard for each other. For the youngsters growing up, you either go one or two ways. Rugby's always got to be the main sport in Hoyk. <laughs> they mentioned rugby in me. I'm from Glasgow originally, so it was difficult for me coming here. I started school here and I had to play rugby and I hated it. <laughs> for attracting players, it's really difficult. Banging you know, heads off the wall, trying to get players here. I've always said I wouldn't walk across the road to watch rugby. Nobody was really interested in Albert when it was run by Edinburgh. It's like Hoyk Royal Albert, but no Hoyk boys and that, and it just didn't look right. They didn't the train here or anything like that, and it was just kind of crap. <laughs> People started drifting away, and now we've got a local team, more people comes down, and there's more buzz about the town, about the club. The support we've had trying to build it up again has been brilliant. Can't afford anybody. We're getting attendances down here. I think the loss has been 45. People know everybody in the paper, folk know the team. I actually know that person who's playing in that park. I think it brings the community together. Why do we keep it going? Just because I love football. <laughs> I don't like rugby. We're average. If we get hammered, I'm not really bothered, to be honest, because we're all local boys and we're all fighting together, so I'm happy. Let's see how far we can go. Can as amateur players building up through the bottom? I've been here for 47, 48 years, and I would never give it up. I'd have to take his out in the coffin. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>